YouTube, I'm Gail Colmar. At this point, I think it's clear that if we're going to wear a mask that is actually effective, we need to choose a mask that is a high quality, three layer disposable mask made out of actual filtration material and not just cloth. I could go buy a box of masks at my local big box store, but I want a mask that is made in America, independently rated and tested, and that I know is safe to breathe through. In this video, I'm gonna be unboxing my favorite filtration material for masks. It's basically like an N95 filtration material. I'm going to open up the package, show you what it is, show you how to buy it on the website, and extend a coupon code to you. In my next video, I'm gonna show you how to use the material to make my new fast mask pattern. I love these masks. They're disposable masks made out of this N95 filtration material. They are easy to wear, comfortable, easy to breathe through, and you can alter these to suit you. One more thing, I want you to know that this video is not sponsored. I just really love this filtration material, and I think you will too. And let's go ahead and unbox my Filthy package. I'm excited to show you the filtration material that I ordered from filthy.com that I'm going to use to make my new surgical style disposable fast masks. When I open up the Ziploc, I see a face mask material data sheet. Let's take a quick moment and look at the filthy specs. This tells me the material composition, polypropylene spun bound, polypropylene composite nanofiber and polyester composite fiber media up to 95% efficient at 0.3 microns, three layer filthy design, surgical face mask applications. That is exactly what I'm doing with this. Material comparison. When compared, filthy face mask material far exceeds standard cloth and fabric materials in efficiency percentage, which is why in some of my other masks, like my Conestoga, my Breathe Easy, and the Olsen mask, I added a filter liner. I created a filter pattern so the filter could just be set in there with some Velcro because I just don't like using only fabric for the best particle capture rates. Let me open up this taped down packaging and I'm going to go in here and pull out my filthy mask material. This is like I said, flat. I'll call it yardage because it is literally just materials sort of off a bolt and then fold it up. The width of this fabric is coming up as 24 and 3 eighths. I ordered 21 square feet, therefore the length of this should be 10 and a half feet. I believe the fabric that I got last time from Filthy was a little wider than this. This fabric should allow me to make about 54 fast masks. Let's just take a look at this fabric closely. It is fairly thick and it is composed of three layers. So when I peel this apart slightly, you can see I have this thin layer and this layer, and then in the middle, that's that inner layer. This side of the fabric is a bit fuzzy, has some dots or indentations on the surface, and is the side that you want facing away from your face. I am calling this the right side of the fabric. This other side of the fabric is a bit smoother, has many more little indentations, and is the side that you want to wear closest to your face. This is what I'm calling the wrong side of the fabric. When you log on to filthy.com, you will land on this page. Go ahead to the middle top of the page and click masks. And then scroll down to the bottom of this page where it says people also buy. And we are going to be shopping for mask material today. Click shop now. And you will be offered several choices. You can choose 21 square feet, 107 square feet, or 215 square feet of mask material. I have chosen 21 square feet. You can also choose white or green. 
I've chosen white. So I'm gonna add 21 square feet of white mask material to my card. So I'm excited about this product. Let me bring you down here to specifications. I want to point out it is made in the USA. It is mechanically efficient, not electrostatically charged. It does not contain fiberglass or other harmful material that you would not want to inhale. Um, it is easy to breathe through, which I love. And it is 95% efficient at 0.3 microns. 0.3 microns is the hardest particle size to capture. And so anything that performs really well here is most likely going to perform better, both larger and smaller particle sizes. There is a nanofiber network layer, which is hardly visible to the naked eye. And again, third-party testing results. So I think this is a wonderful product. And then let's go ahead and view the cart. And you can see what I've ordered here. It's $29.99. I am going to go ahead and click the coupon code box and I'm going to type in Gale 10 and apply the coupon and you can see right here that that has taken off 10%. Try Filthy Mask Material. I think you're really going to love it. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to make a large batch of fast masks out of the safe and efficient mask material with a tricky technique I think that you are going to love and issue you a fast mask challenge. So basically, if you can fold paper and sew a halfway decent straight line, you are going to make these in no time at all.